gosh. Like, how do you kick them off the bed when they look this cute, you know? Good morning. <laughs> I haven't even brushed my hair, so do not mind my appearance. It is Sunday morning. It is a long weekend. I was gonna start the vlog yesterday. I just wanted the day off. I was like, I just don't wanna have any agenda today. So it was really nice just to do nothing. Um, but today I thought I would vlog like today and Monday and just kind of I just look such a mess. Um, but today I thought I would just vlog today and tomorrow to kind of just show you guys like things that we're doing on a long weekend. I don't have really any work planned, just things around the house and spending time with my family. So I think we have some, I was gonna say some fun things planned. I don't wanna like <laughs> lie to you. <laughs> we have things planned. And then I have some like things around the house that I wanna do. Um, but I don't want to spoil it all in the beginning of the video. So let's hop right in and make, actually I'm all out of herbal coffee. So we're making some rooibos tea today. <sighs> so good. I was gonna make a smoothie. I kind of just want some peanut butter and jam toast. If you saw my breakfast I eat every single week lately, you'll know that was one of them. I'm out of homemade chia jam right now, but I do have this other one. This one's really good. It's by Healthy Crunch and it's a store-bought option for chia jam. It's great, um, it's just low sugar sweetened with just fruit and it has chia seeds in it already. So you can't make your own, although mine's like a, 15 minute recipe. It's really easy. I'm just, I'm just, can't even do that one. <laughs> so I'm going to use the store bought one because I already have it. Right here is my peanut butter and jam toast. Chia jam. Easy, simple. I might have a smoothie later, but for now, this will do. You ready for breakfast? <laughs> she looks horrified. Uh, how did you get so big, Stacey? <laughs> Look how tall she is. Wow, you can have breakfast? Mommy's making you oatmeal. Yeah. What are you looking at? We still have to make our bed. Can Mommy have a kiss? Mwah. <laughs> Can we have a kiss? Just come on, kiss. No. Sometimes I just pretend like she's hugging me. Thank you. <laughs> My big baby. My big baby. Look at the belly. Look at the belly. All right, so I'm just heating up some, or not heating up, I'm cooking her oatmeal. And I'll probably share how I make some more of her food and like an upcoming what I eat in a day video. I feel like now that she's eating food, we'll probably do like mommy and baby what I eat in a day. Oh, that actually sounds really cute. Yeah, we should definitely do that. Stay tuned for that since like I'm trying to eat similar foods to her. So it's just easy for me to cook. Okay, but we're gonna go make a mess with oatmeal. And then get daddy to clean it up. <laughs> get daddy to clean it up. Yeah. <laughs> So I usually just give her some toys to play with. Oh, you're already escaped. You escape artist. Yeah? Go play with your kale. Breakfast is almost done, I know. <laughs> please, don't, please don't yell. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. Sorry, it has to cool down. Num, 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 num. There you go. <laughs> yeah, hold on, you're right. There you go. Mm. Um, um. Mama? Uh -huh. Mama? Oh no. 
Where'd it go? Oh. We are just getting ready for a hike. Matt is suiting up Miss Sage and still looks gloomy out, but we're gonna, it's gonna be like a good hiking weather cause it's gonna be zero bugs. It's a nice cool temperature and Sage is gonna have an amazing nap. I can feel it, right Matt? Oh, I think so. <laughs> I also just had a really nice uh, FaceTime with my friend Ashley, who is Prego, and I'm just so happy for her. So um, yeah, it's just fun having my friends have their own babies too. So uh, that was really fun just to catch up and see the bump and you know, she's growing Sage's future best friend. So I'm very excited for her and her growing family. What Matt's really like. <laughs> so I got my lip butter from Beauty Nut Skincare. A little snack. I'm gonna have this because I am hungry, and then we'll have lunch when we get back. And then I'm bringing. This is a collapsible water bottle. It's really lightweight, so once we're done drinking it, it just goes down. And we sell this on the shop as well. I'll have it linked down below. But this is what I am bringing. Someone is not happy. It's her nap time. Okay, daddy's gonna get you out. All right, CG is suited up. <laughs> Gotta get cash now. actually haven't been out here for a week now and I've just felt off we've done like walks and stuff like in near our house but there's something about a walk in the forest I know I call them hikes people laugh if you're from the mountains this is not a hike but there's some hills you know it's a hike for us we're out in nature we're walking it's a hike but yeah this just like fills my cup up you know feels so good out here and I like to come out here as much as I can before, you know, officially summer hits because then it starts to get too muggy and a lot of mosquitoes come. So there some, there's some mosquitoes out right now. I see them floating around Matt. Ooh. Oh yeah, there's mosquitoes. I did not bring my mosquito spray. Sage, what do you think? Do you like it out here? Yeah. <laughs> Aww. Aww. Gotta always do one of those, okay. Good What's happening here? What's happening? Let's go down, Daddy. Oh. All right, so I am, we're back. I'm just gonna heat up some of Sage's food. It's broccoli puree. I've been doing this double broiler thing for heating up purees. And I'm probably gonna mix it with a little bit more breast milk. I'm also giving a little broccoli to cashew. Ready, set, go. I think she likes it. Let's see if she likes it. Cashew, it's right here. Oh, you're not even eating it. I thought you ate the first one. Okay. She just thinks it's a toy. Oh, she's eating it. Good girl. Why we do broccoli? We do broccoli. Gonna be so strong. What that? What this one? What that one? Ooh. You like your broccoli? Oh, that's a lot. So much to say. Oh. <laughs> 
She's a pro at that now. All right, Sage is sleeping. And now we're working on a fun pro, oh, it's so bright. The sun has come out. We are working on a fun project. Oh, it's down right now. <laughs> we are putting up a projector screen because we're gonna have my sister over with the kids and do a little backyard movie night. We've had this projector since last summer, so. Anyways, I will link the kit down below. How much was it? It wasn't too bad. It's like 160 bucks. So yeah, it was like 160 bucks for the whole kit. Um, so, I mean, we'll let you guys know how it works after we use it and then I can recommend it, but. It's definitely we're just, more fairly priced one. Yeah, it's like some of them can be more expensive. So I think it's gonna do the job and it came with the screen. Yeah, we're gonna do a little movie night out here and I think it's gonna be a good night too because it's hot, but not crazy hot today. So it came with like these little sticker hook things, kind of like 3M hooks. So we're just hanging that up right now. Mm. Matt's that making fun of me because we're filming and I'm like, oh, can I do one? And he's like, you just want to do it because you're on camera. That is not true. I was helping out with this before I started the camera, okay? Just to point that out. I think it looks pretty good. Wow. That's a nice white screen. Right, Cash? We're just taking all the covers off everything because it was raining yesterday. So while Sage sleeps and Matt just gets everything set up outside, I'm actually gonna run to the grocery store to get snacks. I think I'm gonna make one of my popcorn, homemade popcorn recipes. Excuse me. Just make yourself at home, okay? Just make yourself at home. I think I'm gonna make one of my homemade uh, popcorn recipes from my cookbook. And then I think I also might swing by Home Depot to look at their plants and stuff. So we'll see if there's a lineup. Tomorrow I would like to do our gallery wall in the dining room and then also pot some plants. So we'll see how the lineup is so I can get that. I feel like May 2-4 is like the weekend to start the gardening and the planting and all that. I'm not gonna get like all the vegetables and stuff yet, but if they have like just some outdoor plants that I can put out. And then I also have some plants indoors that died after Sage was born. I just didn't have time to water them. So I gotta get some newbies to fill those up as well. Tell me this girl's not so cute. Cashew. <coughs> Uh, so I just did some errands. I had to go to Home Depot. I got a bunch of plants and where else did I go? I went to LCBO and then I also went to Zares to get some groceries for the movie night and just for the week. I kind of did like a really fast meal plan for this week and now I'm heading home. Matt did call me because Sage was freaking out. She woke up from her nap and I think, I don't know if she's constipated, like she's just starting solids now and stuff. So uh, she didn't poop yesterday. By the way, this is what you talk about when you're a parent, poop all the time. And yeah, I think she's just having issues going. So we have some prunes, uh, like mashed up prunes at home. So he's gonna give her some of that and just some water to give her some liquid. And I think I'm gonna give her a bath, uh, do a nice uh, warm bath with me. Hopefully it'd help get things going and just calm her down. Um, he did tell me that she stopped freaking out. So I'm not like in a crazy rush. But I'm gonna head back home and just give her some cuddles, breastfeed her, and hopefully she feels better soon. So for dinner tonight, we are doing some broccoli. I have some honey Dijon marinated pork chops. We never really eat pork chops, but I got these the other day from a butcher place in Toronto and they were so good, I got them again. And then they also have um, some delicious uh, homemade pasta. This is the butcher, Cumbres. But their pasta is actually made in Tironi's, which is our favorite restaurant. Um, so it says right there, made by Tironi. And this one is a spinach, lemon, and ricotta, like tortellini. So I'm gonna have that with a little olive oil sauce. And that is gonna be our dinner before all the snacks. So we're gonna have dinner a little bit earlier tonight so we can give Sage a bath, put her to bed, and then do snacks for movie night. Cheeseburgers raining from the sky. And Daddy is hanging out with Seiji, watching a movie. Well, I'll tell you the chance of meatballs, but now it's hamburger time.
All right, there you have it. Pork chops, pasta, broccoli. Looks so good. Mm-mm-mm. Okay, we're gonna go eat now. Oh my gosh. You're adorable. I can't even handle this cuteness. <laughs> like, how do you kick them off the bed when they look this cute, you know? Got the snacks, got the egg chair. It's a little chilly, but I'm gonna put the fire on soon and warm up. What are we watching? Monster in Love? Monsters and Love? I'll pop it here, it's really good. We've already seen it, but not everyone. So cute. <laughs> you yeah, like that? She's unsure. Are you Sage's new babysitter? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what movie are we watching? I don't know. No? I am. Match yourself love. I think that's what it's called. Matt's trying to figure out the projector. I don't know. Chloe actually lined oh. it up really this well. This is the one we have. I'll link it below. We'll see yeah. if it no, I know, but I'm gonna link it below. <laughs> I'll link it below. Matt, can you give me the link for this? <laughs> <laughs> um, she yelled we're... at me for wanting for buying this. Yeah, because yeah, you bought it last year, and it sat in a box. Well, we're using it now. <laughs> and I bought it in like it's like September or something, I think. So it's like we kind of missed the season. Have I changed everything? We started. Good idea, Matt. So they're still kind of in their honeymoon phase. It's happening! Woo! Scared. We could have got some. Whoa! What, fireworks? Yeah, I was like, oh, we got an entire, and there's like the firework place. Wait, are you vlogging? Yeah. Are you, oh, you know the word vlog? What? Look at you. Yeah. You know all Do you watch stuff. YouTube? I, I watch your videos. Ooh, you watch my videos? Sneaky, yeah. sneaky. Wow. battery it's good good morning happy feels like Sunday it's Monday but it's a long weekend so it's kind of like Sunday number two you know so this morning was a little interesting Sage is super constipated so I basically spent the morning in the bath with her trying to get her to poop finally pooped on me I think it was the carrots it looked like carrot juice pulp to be honest and I will just never look at juice pulp the same. <laughs> but yeah, I just finished updating you guys on Instagram stories. Sometimes it's weird vlogging and being on Instagram at the same time, which I'm on Instagram every day. So if you're not following me, follow me here. And I just finished telling you guys, yeah, I basically was in the bath with her. It really helped. And I think it was, well, I know it was the carrots because I saw it in her rabbit poop that looked like juice pulp. So we're gonna hold off on the carrots for a little bit. She really liked them, but I just think they're too fibrous. I don't know. I think there's not enough like liquid in them. So we are going to stick to maybe some broccoli today, lots of water and milk, uh, breast milk. So I'm actually going to take some out of the freezer. But anyways, poop aside, last night was so much fun. The movie night was a success and we went to bed way too late, like after midnight. And Sage also slept in like the whole night. She slept the whole night, which was amazing. It's like she knew... Like I went to bed at midnight knowing I'm probably gonna have to wake up at 3.30 in the morning, which is always the case, 3.30, 4 a.m. to feed her and then put her back to bed. But last night, it's like she knew, she's like, mommy needs her sleep. Although I woke up with like my boobs so full and I was like, get the baby, I need to empty these. So we are making a, it's like 10.30, we're making brunch. 
I'm making, normally I make my own pancakes and they're really easy, but I've had this in the cupboard for a while. It's by Birch Benders. It's like a keto waffle and pancake mix. Just add water. The ingredients are pretty good actually. I don't know if it's good yet because I haven't had it, but I just popped it in here. Sage is up again. She's only been sleeping half an hour for her nap and I have a feeling she pooped because usually she wouldn't be, like she's on her stomach. I have a feeling that she pooped. Okay, anyways, we're gonna make breakfast. We got bacon in the oven. I'm gonna make pancakes. Matt just took a shower. Ayo. And that is how our fake Sunday Monday is going. Why oh, some boys don't poopy? She only slept 25 minutes. I know. You're not having a good day, huh? Right, they're just cooking up. I've been trying to cook more in the cast iron pan just for added iron in our food. And it's just more eco-friendly or non-toxic friendly, I mean. Got some raspberry swirl here. I'm cooking everything in some Lee's ghee instead of butter. I love to cook my pancakes in this and they have a maple one that's really yummy too. This is how the pancakes turned out. A little messy because I was kind of going back and forth with sage. Matt did some oven bacon. I think he might make some eggs on the side. I'm hungry, I'm just gonna have this. And then I did roughly cut up a mango. I was giving some to Sage, so that's just a leftover of that. And we're gonna eat. Yeah, some of them are a little burnt, but I'm sure they're gonna taste good with some maple syrup. Just finished cleaning up. I got the oils going. I've been trying out this new blend. It's kind of resembles the Anthropology Volcanic Candle. And this is what I have, grapefruit, northern lights black spruce, geranium, lime, and tangerine. And it honestly smells so good. I love diffusing oils in my house instead of candles because you don't have to worry about toxins being burned into the air. And I like that you can play around with different scents. I'm gonna put in the info box the amounts that I put of each one so you guys can try it out at home. I also have a full oils email course. It's free um, that you guys can take to learn more about oils. It's a seven day course and you get like free downloads and stuff. And you can learn more about oils, why I love them, and different recipes that you can use throughout your home. Then I got some skincare and makeup items I ordered online. I'll link them down below for you guys. This is a natural baby sunscreen from Think Baby. This is my favorite face scrub by Acure. I keep it in the shower, I love it, so I'll link it below. It's made from sea kelp and French green clay, and it's amazing, I love that. This is my favorite mascara. I got a new vitamin C serum. This I'm trying out, it's a nia niacinamide. It's basically like a B vitamin for your skin with zinc. How do you say that? Niacinamide. And then I got, usually you guys know, I do the Andalou CC cream, uh, which is also a sunscreen. And then usually I'll mix that with the Green Beaver sunscreen, but this is kind of like a two-in-one. It's a tinted, face sunscreen 30 SPF and I've heard that it's very like mattifying and it's a little bit more expensive but I a little goes a long way usually with these guys so I'm gonna try that out and let you guys know what I think but that's just my little skincare makeup haul that I got to try out some some favorites some newbies all right we are heading for another hike before we do some things around the house and I'm just gonna slap on some of my Oh, I actually match it today. My Pit Refresh from Beauty Nut Skincare. Oh, that's what it looks like. Bergamot lime flavor, or not flavor, scent. You could eat it because it's just clean ingredients, but I wouldn't recommend it. Wouldn't taste very good. So I'm gonna put some of that on so I am not stinky during our hike. And I'm gonna grab some water and my lip butter and I think we are good to go. I might vlog a little bit today as well. Cashew baby! Oh, we go for a hike. Oh, <laughs> we go for a hike. Yeah, it is 22 today. It's beautiful. So it's probably going to be really busy, right? She knows where we're going. <laughs> Out on another hike. And we're going to take Kasha to the dog park for a little run. You tell him, girl. You we did him. buy another carrier for her that's a little bit more ergonomic for frontward facing. But she's still a little underweight for it. So we have to wait. Right? <laughs> mm. Mm. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's so cute. Little cutie. Got cashew sniffing around. It's hot outside, but birds are chirping. It's really, yeah, it's really nice. I could go into a pool today. <laughs> oh, So I got all these herbs and we got to pull out the dead ones from last summer. The sage came back and so did, I think this is chives. So we just have to pull out all the other stuff and plant in the new stuff. I also have a bunch of pots from my office plant wall that did not make it when sage was born. So I got some new plants to put in those. And then also I got these two plants just for the backyard. This is a something majesty. I forgot. And I think that they're just both palms. So I think they'll look cute just to add some greenery. And then we still have to do the garden. So ignore that. That'll be for another vlog. Okay, I just collected more from the house. This one's from the front. It got overwatered, died. This is a pothos that never grew past this. It's kind of been annoying. It's been like this for, I swear, six months. So I'm going to swap it. And then these are some new succulents I got the other day and a couple of other ones. This one I just want to fix because it keeps toppling over. This guy's the dill. He's been out here one day, he's not doing well. He needs some water. I think he'll perk right back up. So I'm just gonna first position them where I wanna put them and then I'll dig the holes. Last year, I don't know why, we didn't get parsley and cilantro. I don't know. Anyways, we got them. That's just these, so much dirt in the air. Okay, fills the worm. I think I maybe got too many. I got stevia. I thought that'd be cool for um, like iced teas. And then I got, what's this? Peppermint. Nah, so, yeah okay let's which ones we use for sure we use oregano rosemary dill thyme cilantro and parsley maybe the other ones like peppermint can i don't know maybe some of these can be in their own thing Matt just passed me a drink. It's sparkling water with lime. This is my kind of, cheers. Cheers. I feel like I've been gardening all day. I've only been up there for an hour. I know. <laughs> I'm covered in dirt. I'm just gonna let the pots dry for a little bit and then I'll bring them back in and I'll fill up my plant wall behind me. By the way, if you guys have not watched like my whole office transformation video, I have a full video and blog post with everything linked. I'll link that down below. Um, but yeah, for the most part, a lot of them are doing well. It's just when Sage was born, the last thing on my mind was like watering plants, you know? So the ones that are here just mean that they will survive anything because they definitely got forgotten about. Oh, that's good.
All right, baby is sleeping. Now it is our time to feel like we did pre-parenthood. No, I'm kidding, but like not. This is like the time where we're like, we forget we have a baby and we just like go back to our old ways and go to bed way too late. So it is like, what time is it? I have no idea actually. It must be 7.30, 7, around there. And yeah, Sage is sleeping. Um, I don't even know if we're gonna have dinner. We, I was chatting with my mom and I was snacking on corn chips and salsa and I swear I like, before I do it, I like devoured half the bag and then I realized that I'm no longer really hungry for dinner. I think we're just gonna have snacks, like a little snack plate tonight for dinner. It's funny because growing up, I feel like my mom never really did a proper dinner on Sunday. I feel like you either, your family either does like a big Sunday roast every Sunday or like they're just like fend for yourself get a snack, make some cereal for dinner. I don't care. And like my mom, a lot of times on Sunday would just make a big snack plate with like grapes and crackers and cheese and dried meats. And that would be our dinner. And I feel like I kind of just want to start doing that now because I just don't want to be bothered. Like I got groceries for the week, but I'm just like, and today's Monday. Why do I keep thinking it's Sunday? Well, I know why, because it's a long weekend, but still. Work week doesn't start till tomorrow, but it just messes me up these long weekends, especially now with like us being in quarantine still. It just doesn't feel like a long weekend. It's really weird. Yeah, I thought I would end today's vlog. Um, another another bit of a random vlog. I don't know. They're kind of the days are just blending into one. Uh, but the weather's getting warmer, and I feel like we're just gonna start, you know, just planning mini family adventures. Whether like going to do a picnic, going for a drive somewhere fun, and just you know getting out of the house and just being outside as much as we can. So thank you so much for watching, and I'm excited for some future videos videos I have coming up so get ready we're doing like actually I'm not gonna tell you we'll keep them a surprise but I have a ton of videos I actually want to film now that I'm six months postpartum and Sage is six months and like there's just a lot so get ready and uh, make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss out on a future video and you will see lots of me with no makeup and messy dried hair <laughs> we keep it real here so thank you so much for watching guys subscribe thumbs up this video if you like vlogs and I will see you guys in my next one have a fabulous rest of your day Mwah. Bye, guys.